Hello everyone, this is Tiash. I hope you guys watched our day one video of Yellowstone trip. This is our second day tour of Yellowstone. Please watch it. For our second day, we planned for three major attractions, fountain paint pots, grand prismatic, spring and old faithful geysers. Initially, we thought after covering these three points, we will also visit Grand Teton National Park but then dropped our plan and thought of spending more time in these three points and also to the other points which will come in between. We started from our lake hotel in the early morning, see the morning sunrise near the Yellowstone Lake. We stopped by few places before reaching our first destination and finally we reached to our first destination that was Fountain Penport. We started quite early in the morning but uh, still saw the parking space is almost full so guys please start early if you want to park your car the fountain paint pot is located in wyoming and it's a mud pot which is in the lower geyser basin of yellowstone national park it's named for the yellow red and brown colors of the mud derived due to oxidation states of the iron in the mud it is worth of visiting because it has all of the hydrothermal features of the Yellowstone National Park like mud pots, geysers, hot springs and fumaroles. The geysers erupt very frequently here. Please watch the video to experience this area more. After this, we started for our next destination and that was Grand Prismatic Spring. Grand Prismatic Spring is also located in Wyoming and 
The 160 feet deep Grand Prismatic is the largest hot spring in the United States and, and the third largest in the world. Here extremely hot water travels 121 feet from the, a crack in the earth to reach the surface of the spring. The hot spring has bright bands of orange, yellow and green ring in the deep blue water in the spring. The different species of thermophilic bacteria living here in different thermal zones are the sources of the colors. This is a heaven for the photographers. Please write your thoughts about this area after seeing our videos and photos in the comment section. After soaking into the wonderful experience of Grand Prismatic Spring, we started for the next destination that is Old Faithful Geyser. Old Faithful Geyser was named for its frequent and somewhat predictable eruptions, which number more than a million since Yellowstone became the world's first national park in 1872. It is in the upper geyser basin and in the southwest section of the park. The geyser viewing area is the most accessible and visitor friendly. We all waited there patiently with other visitors to see the next eruption and it was worthy of time and patience. See guys. It's finally time to say goodbye Yellowstone, our heart is full, there is no Wi-Fi in the nature but I promise you will find a better connection here. I hope this video is helpful to you guys who wants to visit, visit Yellowstone very soon and don't have much time in their hands like us. Thank you for watching. See you soon. Bye. Please write your valuable feedback in the comments if you like this video. Thank you so much.